Hey, welcome to another week here at the Tour Lane. So we are trying to finish the outside trench. Um, I have the students again, they're helping me dig. And then uh, we also want to uh, try to finish the grading for it. So it's all perfect so that next week we can install the French drain itself. And then I have a few little things that we are just clearing on the outside. Some concrete um, that we still have to put on a pile and taking down a tree and um, some other stuff. So as you saw, I had the guys come out again, the students, and help me finish the drench. They were able to finish that whole section in front of the house, which was great before uh, we all had to head out anyways. And now the next thing is I have to level it all out. So now that we dug the trench all the way to the end, we now need to even out the spots where it's a little high or a little too low so, so that we can next week hopefully start installing the actual drainage pipes in it and so let's get to it. So there's two spots that are all high, one here in the middle of the wall and then on the far side where the gas pi uh, pipe is coming in the house, I just have to go down an inch there so that we have a nice even slope everywhere. One more thing before we can call this all finished is I want to take some of the dirt that is against the foundation or below the foundation here um, off so when we install the water um, membrane next week, the waterproofing membrane that I can attach it all the way to the wall and not have some dirt behind it. So I'm going to clean off that section here towards the wall.
This is much better now. We can install waterproofing membrane all along here in the foundation area so that even here long term we won't have any issues. I will do it in a level, uh, level section all the way from the door here and then come out level to probably somewhere around here just so that when we put a wall here and we make a driveway all nice and level here we have the membrane already covering the entire foundation wall here and then on the inside I cleaned up a little more without the camera because it just wasn't any angles that I could with the light, could get with the light but I basically um, dug out the rest of the section over here so we are ready for a membrane over on this side that has those dimples to keep a little bit away from the wall but unfortunately I have to order that this is a special order they don't have it in stock so hope it comes on time for next week so that I can order also the gravel I already have the, the fabric and I have enough pipe now so we should be able to finish the drain next week if the gravel and the water membrane is here item that we got done this week is taking down the tree that was covering up our porch and first reason obviously it was damaged and second reason why we took it down is because it is obviously in the middle of our driveway this whole mound of dirt and debris that is here we will take it down we have a backhoe scheduled to come in two weeks so we can try to get all of this done and push all that mound here that we have here plus that entire section over here down into our drive uh, into our backyard because it's obviously already lower so we want to even it all out and get a little higher level plus we will need quite a lot of dirt still over here where our driveway itself is so we are going to use the backhoe to even all of this out so let me give you guys a little update on the windows i talked with the uh, warehouse and they told me the windows are arriving on november 4th unfortunately i am heading out to brazil to on november 5th so i won't be able to get the windows until i come back for the people that don't know um, i have a friend um, who's a missionary they're doing translation work in a tribe in the jungle so they are living there he and his family they are living there right now in an old um, building that is uh, termite infested and uh, really needs to be replaced so um, a a few friends of mine and I decided to go and help and come um, just helping them build their house their new house so they have poured uh, with some natives a foundation and flooring already this week and now um, the first team left uh, yesterday actually for the trip and they are in charge of building the walls and putting the roof trusses up and then our team Hopefully can finish the roof, put the metal roofing on it, and then do the siding. We will see if we can get it all done in a five-week um, trip with four people and four people on the two different uh, teams. The, um, the first team took one of my GoPro cameras, so we can hopefully get some footage um, from them as they are building. And then when I'm there, obviously, I'm going to film that part, and we will see if we can put one or maybe two videos together uh, that we're going to share on the, on the trip too. So... 
um, attention for everybody obviously who might like that or might not um, obviously I will mark it so that everybody knows this is not one of our build videos but that it's the build video from the jungle so we'll try to um, see what we can there obviously the disadvantage there is while we are building in the jungle we have to take everything that we uh, need with us so all um, screws nails everything has to be taken in by plane uh, it's one of the small bush planes they have some boats that are coming in through the river um, but the river is very low right now so they can only take so much material because they have actually have to portage the boat over some of the rapids areas um, and it's very unsafe otherwise so we can take a little bit of material in there but the majority of our materials that we will need is all coming in by plane and the plane can only take uh, so much weight with obviously additionally it also has to carry us so we are very limited on what we can bring and we obviously don't have a Lowe's or Home Depot right next door when we say hey we forgot something we need so we will just have to make do with what we are bringing so I'm very excited about this uh, build um, it's going to be challenging we have all the plans made up it's going to be I think a beautiful house for them and hope um, you guys enjoy the videos that we are gonna bring out um, obviously I don't know yet exactly when those videos will be um, showing on the channel but I would assume somewhere in December after I come back and we can um, edit it all I will try to do a couple um, weekly updates there while I'm there if I have um, good enough internet connection uh, they have some satellite internet but it is obviously not very reliable especially if the weather is not good so I hope I can get a couple videos out it's going to be very short probably one to two minutes just saying hi and telling you guys how it's going but um, that's coming up in the middle of November so stay tuned um, I'm looking forward um, and I hope you guys too well I think this is it for this week I hope you guys have a wonderful time um, and I will see you guys the next time I turn on the camera bye